final. Are you? Ah, whoa! Ah! S Sense Sensei's melted like butter! Dude, that wasn't the real you. Though this is kind of a gross way to prove it. Huh? What was that? Hey, Yosuke. And that was a shadow, not Sensei, right? Yeah, seems like. The real you, I'm pretty sure, wouldn't melt into goo like that. Hmm, that's true, but... Uh, what is it? You're being really cagey today. Uh, Labichan's kidnapper said he wanted to steal our personas and make them into shadows, right? Do you think Sensei's persona got stolen and became that thing you fought? What? Like hell that would happen! Wait, it wouldn't, right? Uh, don't ask me! I asked you first! Anyway, we gotta hurry and find the others. This whole thing is making me more and more nervous. And man, suddenly I can use my persona in the real world? What's happening to this town? Huh? What's up? I smell the real sensei! And from the other direction, I'm sniffing... Oh, it's Yuki-chan! Really? Can you smell the other guys, too? Uh, no, just those two. Actually, this might not be good. I sense shadows real close to both of them. What? Damn it. Oh well, we're gonna have to split up. We need to make sure everyone's safe first. After that, we can meet up at Juness. I'm sure you won't get lost with that nose of yours. Alrighty then. In that case, it's time to fully open up my bare nostrils. Rawr! Wait for me, Yuki-chan! Your teddy is coming for you! Hey, hey, wait! You didn't tell me where you is! Rawr! Yuki-chan! Damn it, you perverted bear! You are so getting a pay cut for this! Welcome to the Velvet Room. Did I startle you? No, but... I have business with you today, so I've summoned you. 
Marie? Sorry, I asked her to do this. There's something I have to do right now. What happened? I can't really tell you because of the rules of this room, but you've noticed, right? Something terrible is about to happen to this town. I'll do my best to stop it, but that won't even come close to being enough. So, you might end up in danger again. Because of this. Leave it to me. I'll protect this town from whatever's coming. Marie, are you okay? You stupid goody-goody womanizing lame -o. Just hurry and get out of here! <laughs> it seems you still have a lot to learn. You may have noticed, but your precious town faces an even greater threat than before. Someone is attempting to merge Inaba with the other world, which you once called the Midnight Channel. What? Fortunately, Marie's powers are currently protecting the townspeople. But that will not last long. What do you mean? A town that's become a labyrinth choked by fog and silence. Inaba exists in a unique time right now. Only Persona users, who have accepted their suppressed egos, are able to freely move about through the evil Red Fog. But at this rate, the fog will thicken, and those who cannot use such powers will be swallowed into this world. So that's what General Teddy meant by within the hour. <laughs> this will be the third ordeal thrust upon you. Or perhaps it is the continuation of the second. Will you overcome it with a plum this time as well? Go. You can do this. And as for the culprit in this case. It's odd. I passed by here earlier, too. Margaret called this a continuation of what happened the other day. This is Juness. Why is it here? Yosuke. Yosuke, wait! Yosuke! Yo, it's you! Well, I had a feeling someone would show up. That's what I was thinking, too. Are you alone? Where's Teddy? Teddy? Oh, that useless ball of fur? <laughs> Are you really Yosuke? Who cares? Either way, you're done for. Plus, take a look at that. What is that? Don't tell me. You understand the rules now? That's where you're headed. If you want to save your precious friends, and this world. Persona. Look out, you! A persona? And two Yosuke's? Don't be fooled! That's a fake me! Don't, Don't get, get in my, my way. way. Persona! This guy's not me or my shadow. It's a fake that was made with a chunk of a shadow. A chunk of a shadow? General Teddy set this up. 
He supposedly made these things to force us to fight. Thing is, we can summon our personas here too. We have to beat them all and move on. Yosuke, are you all right? <laughs> to be honest, I'm exhausted. But if this is more of the P1, we can't let ourselves lose. Oh, so you know this too. The culprit behind Lavish's kidnapping is doing this as well. Right. I don't know what they're after. But let's defeat this thing and keep going. <laughs> Morons! You still you don't get it, do you? You're both going down here. Don't act so tough. You might be a copy of me, but there's no way you can beat you and me at the same time. <laughs> Two against one, huh? We were being all fair and square, but I see you'd rather play dirty. Useless vermin who can't do anything unless you're huddled together. You're completely forgetting the rules. The P1 climax is supposed to be all one-on-one -on -one battles. I'm not going to take on two of you at once. Now, bring on the ring. What is this? Come on! First come, first serve! Oh, and I guess I'll tell you something else. Ignoring me and trying to run ahead will get you nowhere. Like I said before, if you want to stop the world from ending, you've got no choice but to head to Yasugami High. Now, though, you're already in the way. Those red pillars create invisible walls. And there's no way to get rid of them but to win one on one. In other words, the only way you can save your world is for one of you to defeat me. <sighs> Damn it. Invisible walls again? What are we gonna do? Can we trust anything they say? Jeez, you just don't know when to give in. Can't you just go on and fight when it's not against your friends? You already know it's a fake. You. Yes, yes, it's the lovely General Teddy. I've been watching all this time, and what am I seeing? I poured my heart into making things who look exactly like you, all to set up a good fight. What more do you want? Can it? With all that fair and square stuff you were saying, were we somehow not supposed to think something's going on with all this? Yosuke, how cruel. I just want to feel your fighting spirit. Oh, this is fine with me, you know. At such a leisurely pace, the world really will be destroyed. Now, hurry up and fight to the death. <laughs> hey, oh, that bastard. Even the fake one's not half as cute as he thinks. Calm down, Yosuke. Getting flustered is exactly what they want. was a chunk of a shadow. You could have trusted me at least on that part, you know. Though that doesn't make me feel better about seeing this happen so many times. 
Many times? Did you fight a fake version of someone else before coming here? Uh, yeah. It was, um, a fake you. Me? Huh. Are you alright? Oh, sure. I figured out pretty quick that it wasn't you. These guys aren't trying too hard to act like us. It's not like before when they were trying to upset us. That makes it even more disturbing. They're not trying to hide and they're fighting fair. That seems really fishy in itself. Right? Well, the rule where you have to win one-on-one -on -one before moving on seems to be the same as before. But something's telling me we shouldn't believe everything they're saying either. That reminds me, is Teddy okay? Have you seen anyone else? Huh? Oh, Teddy sniffed out Yukiko with that nose of his and took off to find her. Some help that guy was. You have no idea how much trouble I had to go through to find you. Well, he showed up just in time to save me. Anyway, I'm relieved to hear Teddy's nose is working. Let's leave the others to him. We need to get to Yasugami High. There's not much time left until this supposed end of the world. Whoa, wait a sec. That fake said the same thing, but why Yasugami High? I don't know why, but it looks like that's where we have to go. See? Is that Yasugami High? What's happened to it? We'll have to go there and find out. mitsuru san and her friends are probably there too. Damn it, everything's going according to their plan, huh? Yeah, but we have to do this. I'll be counting on your help, Yosuke. Uh, What's the matter? Nah, you're right. It's not that there's nothing we can do without each other. It's that with each other, we can do anything. <laughs> Sorry, guess I wasn't thinking straight. Let's go, partner. These again? How much more are they going to bring up those painful memories? Whoa! Holy crap! It really is on top of our school! Why is it so big? Ah! That voice! Was that Yukiko? Let's hurry! 